need to make this clear. I'm speaking about Western society. I can't speak on women that I don't know personally. I don't live there. I only know what I see on TV, and that's not always accurate. And if I was a man right now in Western society, I would be extremely, extremely afraid to get a woman pregnant. I would be afraid to marry a woman. I would be afraid to commit to a woman in any way, shape, or form. I've seen women that go out to a bar, go home with a man that they just met, hardly know, sleep with them unprotected, and then the next day feel guilty about it and try to say that man raped her. In my opinion, I don't believe men and women are equal. I don't think that uh, we were not biologically designed to be equal. You know, in nature, every other male and female is not equal. You know, as, a, as women, I think we need to stop trying to be something we're not. And I think that is going to ruin our society. Not only ruin it, but it's gonna cause our species to die out. It's just really sad that women just can't accept their role. It's like they're lazy, they don't wanna, how dare you ask them to cook and clean for their family? How dare you ask them, uh, you know, to not go open up their legs to a stranger? How dare you? They want to have the right to kill their own baby because they want to sleep around. They want to go and be a whore and sleep around and, and do it as many times as they want. And they want to be able to kill the baby that is a product of them sleeping around every single time they do it. And if you threaten to take that away from them, they go crazy. I'm against abortion. I think it's disgusting. If you want to sleep around women, you want to be whores, go have your uterus taken out, okay? There is no reason to kill an innocent baby that has not done you a thing. They want to be lazy, they don't want to cook and clean, and they want to be whores. And that's just the bottom line. And I do not blame men for going their own way. In fact, if I was a man, I'd be joining y'all. The average Western woman today is a complete narcissistic, vain, unfulfilled, selfish whore, and that's just the bottom line. Men going their own way doesn't affect me directly. I have a husband. I've achieved that, and I'm very, very grateful for that. But again, um, the whole feminist thing affects me directly, and that's why I do these videos. Men going their own way is, is, the, is the result of feminism. Feminism has destroyed women. Feminism doesn't just affect men. I'm faced with the fact that I can't have any female friends because of the way women are today. And every single time I've had a female friend, she has stabbed me in the back, was jealous of me, tried to sabotage me, competed with me. I really can't stomach being around the average woman today. After about five minutes, I just can't take any more of it. I can't take the things they talk about. I can't take the things that um, everything they talk about is just stupid. You know, at the end of the day, the only thing that really matters to me is my husband and children, is being a good mother and a good wife. That is the only thing that has real importance to me anymore. I really can't stand the fact that the average woman today has children from different men and will use those children as pawns to control the father, to get money out the father, to get money out of the state. Um, I cannot stand how you know women will marry a man just for um, financial support. We do have a two-year-old son and someday he is going to date women and I am scared to death that he is going to get a woman pregnant and she is going to uh, hold that baby over his head, not let us see the baby unless we pay up. I'm so afraid of that kind of thing. I've seen that happen so many times. The average woman today looks down on a woman that cooks and cleans for her husband. I can't tell y'all how many of my female acquaintances that have told me something because when they come to my house, my house is spotless and I always have a home cooked meal. Um, I always cook every single day. They will criticize that, oh, I'm not doing that. That's just ridiculous. He can make his own food. You know, he needs to do his own laundry and that kind of thing. That's how the average woman thinks today. Thank goodness I was raised by my grandparents. 